1997 Import Car of the Year. Imagine zero to 60 in 5.6 seconds and tops 155 miles an hour. A sedan that handles like a sports car, yet rides like a luxury car. That's only one model of BMW 5 Series, and one of the reasons that we named it Motor Trend's 1997 Import Car of the Year. The challenge was to improve what was already one of the world's best sport luxury sedans. The target, make it bigger on the inside and sleeker on the outside. The new 5 Series in any version is all of that, but much more as well, as the BMW engineers raised all their standards, like handling. BMW's got a long history of uh, really hitting uh, suspension settings right on the nose, and the new 5 Series advances that technology this car is so hooked up with the road and feels so precise, it's really a pleasure to drive. Hooked up means a slalom speed over 65 miles per hour with the standard suspension, thanks in part to new aluminum components and a significant reduction in unsprung weight. Or option the six-speed manual with sports suspension and the slalom speed jumps up to match the times of pure sports cars. It's an incredible handling performance for a four-door sedan with a full load of creature comforts and leather seating for five, standard in the 540i, optional in the 5 528i. I think BMW has done a heck of a job with the interior on this car. I mean, there's more room, there's more comfort, the ergonomics are better. And, um, you know, basically it's just loaded with the kind of standards that a driver would really like. Even the base 528i comes with like a power tilt telescoping steering column, 10-way power seats, and it's easy for just about anybody to get incredibly comfortable in the car very quickly. Those interior standards include full auto heating and air controls and a sophisticated sound system with CD, of course, and cassette hidden under real wood. Cruise control and stereo remote buttons are nicely integrated in the wheel on opposite sides of the driver's airbag. Of course, there's a passenger bag and side bag, standard on the 540i, optional on the 528i. If you're confused, the model numbers describe the engine choice. The 528i means the 2.8-liter, 24-valve, dual-cam-6, bringing 190 horses to the party. The 540 is the option, with the 32-valve, 4-cam, V8. Pick your BMW 5 Series in any flavor you want, from 190 horsepower 6 to 282 horsepower, muscle car stomping V8. Heat up the 40 Series Dunlops on the six-speed version, and you've got zero to 60 in 5.6 seconds, and the quarter mile in 14 flat at better than 100 miles per hour. You'll remember that's quicker than the legendary 427 Corvette. You don't remember? Well, check it out. Leave your stress playing stoplight racer, the 540i will run with Mustang Cobras and Z28s. And on the track, the power is there to hang the back out at will in a fully controlled and thoroughly enjoyable power slide. It's your choice. Steer with the precise rack and pinion variable assist up front, or choose your line with power on oversteer in back. Now granted, most 5 Series BMWs won't spend their time hot lapping at Willow Springs Raceway. The vast majority will never spin a tire as they tend to the business of transporting their owners in high-speed luxury and safety, and even guiding them with the optional GPS navigation system. But with any set of options and at any price, from 39,000 on up to the mid-50s, it's clear there is now a new benchmark in sports sedans. During our testing, it quickly became obvious that BMW has set new standards for luxury brands and made it easy for the editors of Motor Trend to name the BMW 5 Series our 1997 Import Car of the Year. Coming next, it's the Duke Boys and the General Lee. It's an American classic, the Dodge Charger RT. 
If you want some extra horsepower or need some extra torque, replace your paper filter with a K&N filter chart. Now, from the Motor Trend Archives, a trip back to the American classics of our automotive past.